Phil, a marketing manager, has called a meeting of the company's marketing team. His boss, Carol, is sitting in to hear the group's ideas. Let's listen in. So what are your thoughts? I think we're missing opportunities for broadening our digital consumer base and leveraging our social capabilities online. I called this ideation session to get my marketing SWAT team concepting ways to increase revenue streams in the e-commerce sphere. Absolutely, Phil. I was thinking the exact same thing. We're working out best practices for shifting our social platforms vis-a-vis -vis Facebook and Twitter with an eye towards consumer interaction and synergistic partnerships with bleeding edge startups and mobile technology. Right. I was thinking the exact same thing. We've got to get mobile. It's all about mobile. Except, Jessica, Facebook is basically worthless as a marketing tool. I think we can drill deeper. Let's hire a team and launch an app. Don't forget, of course, that our main concern still needs to be a healthy margin and shareholder value. Hey, screw shareholder value, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! I've got a 3.30, and I look forward to seeing the work you all do on this. Based on what you've just seen, who do you think appeared the least stupid in this meeting? Was it Ted? Phil, Jessica, Steve, Jan. If you said E, Jan, congratulations, you're correct. While the rest of her colleagues spoke overly complicated nonsense that displayed their utter lack of knowledge and ability to express themselves clearly, Jan employed the successful tactic of silent and sagacious nodding. Despite the fact that she understood nothing that was said and had no original thoughts to contribute, she appeared to be relatively not stupid. Undoubtedly, Carol left the meeting under that impression, and this will take Jan far. If you answered correctly, you may move on to course 102 in the curriculum, fabricating a business personality. If you chose A through D, on the other hand, we recommend that you reread course 101 and then take this quiz again. For further advice on how to appear not stupid and more information on the curriculum, visit your bookseller and get your copy today. Available in print and ebook wherever books are sold. I'm Stanley Bing, and I approve this curriculum.